What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crash on startup or crashing on startup issue you're currently having with days gone. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial and in the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that I would really, really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click and simply hit task manager. What I want you to do next is gonna be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen clicking onto processes just to just ensure that you're sticking around it. Afterwards hit one of those random processes. And type in D in order to find days gone. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, simply right click and end the task. Once you're finished, I want you to end the task manager again. And the next step is going to be to take your Steam or your days gone shortcut on your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen where you're going to click onto the Windows symbol and use the Windows search function in order to find it. Once you found it, simply drag it right back on your desktop. You're going to write or you're going to take it, your shortcut, you're going to right click and hit run as an administrator. Once you click that, your game should pop up or your launcher. And if it crashes again, the next step will probably fix your issue. You're going to right click your Steam shortcut or your Days Gone shortcut. Navigate to the very bottom where it says properties. Afterwards, hit compatibility and simply disable it. Disable full screen optimizations, enable run this program as an administrator and enable run this program in compatibility mode for you. Select Windows 8 and simply hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restored you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your Steam or your Days Gone shortcut and afterwards just simply launch a game or launch a game over the launcher. This should fix your issue. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one guys. If it was like that just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. Yeah guys I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.